He's giving you a chance, so don't be shy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. I want to share something with you. Good. Um, a few years ago, I wanted to find my true love. Oh, okay. I wanted to find my boyfriend to become my husband. So I made two lists. Uh -huh. One list was the fantasy list. And I wrote <laughs> over there all the things that I really want in a man. Uh -huh. For example, to be above one, one meter eighty-five, <laughs> okay. yeah. and with uh, maybe blue or green eyes, smoke for once a while, very smart, intelligent, funny. I wrote everything. Uh, the second list was the realistic list. <laughs> I wrote, so it was like the uh, there were all the red limits mm -hmm. for me. So. Brown eyes, that's okay for me. <laughs> Maybe an average income, okay <laughs> for me. One meter, 78, that's the minimum. Okay, I can put my <laughs> And I really thought about this list and talked to my friends about it, talked to my friends actually, and spread it away. And I've met with uh, my friend at that time, she was single, and we talked one to each other as we have as I have this boyfriend already, like, yes, he's so cute, and we have a great conversation, and he's really nice and funny and very handsome, and I try to make it more realistic for me, without being cynical. Uh, and after a while, I found Amir, and I'm thinking, I, I know for sure, he has all the things on my fantasy list. Wow. Um, <laughs> yeah. So, may I? <laughs> so, so you had a boyfriend, and not I mean, a, a different guy. No, I didn't have. Oh, oh. Yeah, like, yeah. I, I talked to my uh, girlfriend. Uh -huh. when we were two single girls at right. that time. Like I hold, I already had. Heavy. Okay, you're talking like you already had yeah. one. Yeah. But you like didn't have. Secret. One. Okay. Oh. Then you have your before. fantasy list. Yes. And you had your kind of realistic list. It. Yeah, and it made me clear. Uh. Now it was clear for me yeah. what I really want in a man. Yes. Yeah. So you recommend for girls and guys to write down what you want in a man or woman before for a relationship. Yeah. yeah, just to write it down. Huh? Because sometimes it's all mess in your brain. Uh -huh. And if you write things, it becomes clear. Can we ask you a question? No. I mean, no. I mean, I mean this is kind of about you, yeah. yeah. I mean, because you had the big list of fantasy. I mean, uh, I mean, surely did I meet every one of those fantasies? Every, I think there are in the list maybe uh, 20 categories. And, and he, he met most of them, all of them. All of them. All of them. Oh. Wow. wow. Okay, Amir wants to say something. The fantasy man. Come on. <laughs> I think you mentioned before the secret, right? So yeah, yeah. I think the, the book, the secret, the book, yeah. right? So actually, I don't know anything about it. I never read it uh -huh. or saw the movie. But for a lot of people, it seems to work. Mm. Yeah. So I don't know if there's. Uh, again, I cannot speak from my experience. But if someone is searching for something, uh -huh. right? That's probably a good way to get some uh, inspiration from. Yeah. So it worked for a few people. Yeah. Uh, and I guess there is a lot more behind it. So Absolutely. if you never heard of it, check it out. I haven't. So, but yeah, it could work. Uh, I've heard of it. And I know of this. It's a book called The Secret. Thank you. Yeah. But, but what you're really saying is what Ivan said in the beginning. Right. You have a dream. Plan. Write it down. Make a plan. Yeah, make a plan. Once you write it down, it's not a dream anymore. It becomes reality. It becomes a plan. And yours came true. And Amir, uh, you are every day her dream come true. Right. You are so lucky. But you know, I don't know if I'm still keeping it on the list, right? Don't get into too much reality. <laughs> Who is the author of the, the book? Who's the author of the book, The Secret? You're a, a secret girl. fan. Yeah. Who's the author of the book, The Secret? It's a woman. A female. It's a female yeah. author. <laughs> That doesn't tell us much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got it. Very oh, I guess go online, yeah. Just go online and look up the secret. The secret in your pocket.
It's also a movie. Yeah. 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 yeah, interesting. I have a similar experience as Sam did, uh, since I always forgot. 99% of my dreams. But I still remember uh, most of my dreams when I was a child. I had tonsillitis very frequent, oh, very frequent. No. And I always had the same dream, but I couldn't remember. But, uh, yeah, but. <laughs> what happened? When I grew up, uh, I, I did have a terrible uh, car accident. When I was driving my Volvo uh, 360, and I, uh, I was doing my PhD dissertation, and I was very tired. And I had an accident. I collided five cars in front of me. Oh, no. Those cars were just uh, stopped there. <laughs> you mean they were parked? They parked, and oh. I, I fell asleep, and oh. I collided those five cars. Fortunately, uh, no, no injury. Yeah. No one uh, hurt. But after that, I uh, had a very terrible dream. When I, w I, I dreamed I collided a car straight, mm. and that was terrible. And still, uh, one terrible experience is uh, when I was uh, practice my uh, driving right. license, uh -huh. uh, driving uh, lessons. And one day, uh, I took a bus from Shinju to Taipei, and I fell asleep. Oh. And I was dreaming, I, I, <laughs> I am driving a car. And just uh, shocked and pa have a panic. That, that is a kind of terrible experience. Mm. Okay. 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 Don't don't you know don't don't be uh, you know too curious about your dreams. But it's a good idea to uh, write them down. As they say, when you hear a joke, you remember a similar joke. Now <laughs> I've heard Douglas about this this dream. And it reminded me when I got my first new car, a 1966 Dodge Dart. Wow. Beautiful big white car. Oh, I was so happy with it. And every night after I parked the car, I went home, and I had a dream that I stepped on a brake, and the car kept going and crashed into the car ahead of me. Kicked, and I woke up, and said, oh, so good it was only a dream. But it kept repeating for about five or six times afterward. It took me a while to get used to it. After that, I never had a real rear-end accident. I was always keeping a good safety car. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good interpretation. Yeah. So, this one is called recurring dream. That one is called anxiety dream. And yeah. it's, it's, uh, some, some people say that deja vu. Some, uh, a deja vu is when, you, when you're awake and you know what the next moment or, or what person is going to say. It's, it's a, very, uh, a very familiar feeling. That may have something to do with dreams, too. Now, dreams are something that, according to uh, Carlos Castaneda, who wrote the Don Juan uh, series, uh, books. Anyway, Don Juan is a, like a wise man uh, from Mexico. He's a brujo, he's a, a sorcerer. He calls himself a sorcerer. And they've done a lot of work in dreaming. And what uh, uh, Don Juan told uh, uh, Castaneda, that when he falls asleep, to try to concentrate on seeing his hand in the dream. And, and he wrote that it took him about a year of, of persistent uh, effort before he could see his hand. 